we look at this situation, this is a family that lost their son and their brother through an act of violence at the hands and the feet of people who had been charged with keeping them safe. And when I think about the courage and the strength of this family, I think it demands that we speak truth. And with this I will say, this violent act was not in pursuit of public safety. It was not in the interest of keeping the public safe because one must ask, was not it in the interest of keeping the public safe that Tyree Nichols would be with us here today? Was he not also entitled to the right to be safe? So when we talk about public safety, let us understand yeah. what it means in its truest form. Tyree Nichols should have been safe. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So I'll just close by saying this. I was, as a senator, as a United States senator, a co-author of the original George Floyd Justice and Policing Act. And as Vice President of the United States, we demand that Congress pass the George Floyd Justice and Policing Act. Joe Biden will sign it. And we should not delay, and we will not be denied. It is non-negotiable.